Hello students, this is the last video from the chapter Weather, Climate and Adaptations of Animals. Here I am going to discuss about the adaptation of two organisms. One is polar bear, another is penguin that are adapted to the polar climate. That is the very cold climate. Let's start the video. Let me tell you about the polar regions. The polar regions are the regions located near the north and the south poles which have extreme cold climate. The countries located in these polar regions are Canada, Sweden, Greenland, Ireland, Norway, Finland, Alaska and Siberian region of Russia. These regions are covered with snow for major part of the year. For six months, the sun does not set at the poles, while for the other six months, the sun does not rise. The temperature remains below 0 degree Celsius and can be as low as minus 37 degree Celsius. There is hardly any vegetation during the winters. Animals living in these extreme conditions are adapted to these polar regions type of animals found in this polar region they are the polar bear many type of birds reindeer foxes seals and whales so the today's main topic is the adaptation of the polar bear now how do this polar bear adapt themselves in this extreme cold climate let me tell you the polar bear have a thick coat of white fur that helps them to blend with the snowy white background. This adaptation is called camouflaging and it protects the animal from the predators. It also helps them in catching their prey as the prey cannot find them in the snowy background. The second adaptive feature is the two layers of thick Fur keeps the polar bear warm in the cold weather. The third point or the third adaptive feature of this polar bear is a layer of fat is present under the skin known as blubber that acts as insulation, thus keeping the body of the polar bear warm. The fourth point is the excellent sense of smell that helps to locate their prey. The fifth adaptive feature is their paws are flat and broad which help them to walk on the ice without slipping. The sixth adaptive feature is their ears. Their ears are small that help them to conserve the body heat as much as possible. That you will study in the higher class about the Allen's rule. Seventh adaptive feature is the female bear go for long winter sleep called hibernation. They use their fat reserves to survive during this period and also give birth to their young ones. The final adaptive feature of this polar bear is on warm sunny days polar bear cool themselves by swimming in the cold water. They are a very good swimmer and do you know the claws are very very sharp that are useful to dig the snow and find out the prey hidden inside the snow. Second organism adapted to this polar climate is the penguin which I already discussed in the previous video that these birds are found in the Antarctic region while the polar bears are found in the Arctic region. What are the adaptive features of these lovely, wonderful birds? Let's see. Penguins have white feathers on their belly that help them to merge with the surrounding that is same as in the polar bear's case that is camouflaging. The second adaptive feature is the penguins have a thick layer of fat that is blubber that is present under the skin that protects them from extreme cold. And third very important feature is their body is streamlined and the feet are webbed that makes them useful for swimming and they are a good swimmer as well. 
The fourth adaptive feature is they have small ears to conserve body heat. The penguins huddle together in a tight circle in large groups to keep them warm. So students, it was all about the adaptive features of the two polar animals, the polar bear and the penguin. In this chapter, you have learned about the adaptation of the two climatic zones, the tropical and the polar region. We have studied about the weather pattern of the various climatic zones and their various importances. I hope you have understood this topic very well and found it interesting and if you have any type of queries you can comment me down in the comment section. If you find that this video will help your friends then you can share it with more of your friends. If you have not yet subscribed my channel then please do it. Thanks for watching the video.